Hi, this is Dan with StarReviews.com. Today we're going to review the SCN TV product, The Point and Paint. We've all seen an infomercial hosted by Anthony Sullivan, and here's what they claim about the product. The Point and Paint is the solution for a do-it-yourselfer to painting. No longer do you have to tape the corners or tape around an outlet to really get in there and paint. You can paint an entire room in less than an hour is what they claim. This large painter they say holds eight times the amount of paint as a normal paint roller would. And here's what you're going to get in the kit. You get this large painter here. You get the pad that comes attached, you get an extra pad, and also on the back side you have a mini painter. So you get two pads for the mini painter. And let me show you another thing they give you. They give you this paint tray. As you can see here, you just pour your paint in the bottom of the tray, run your roller across the top of it, and that's how you apply the paint to the roller, uh, to the p large paint pad rather. We're going to go ahead and put this to the test, taking it around to various spots where we're going to try to touch up paint. We're going to go around the molding. We're going to use this paint pad and see if it really does work. Okay, so we're here to complete part one of our test. We have the point paint. We have the light blue paint in this paint tray with the roller. We're gonna apply it to the point paint. It's pretty simple. You're just gonna roll this a couple times across the roller. Make sure you have a lot of paint on it. It doesn't drip, and as you can see, it is not dripping. And then we're gonna go ahead and start painting around this door trim. And as you can see, it's pretty easy. You just kind of then when we get to the corner, what you do is you roll it over on that plastic guy and just keep on painting. So boom, just like that. I haven't taped the door. I haven't done anything like that. And it's just quick and easy. You can go over it again. Just make sure you have everything nice and smoothed out. You don't get any appearance of brush strokes on the wall. And I've already cut that door in and it took me literally maybe 30 seconds to do so. And it's perfectly cut in. We're going to go ahead and move along. We have this fire alarm right here. This is going to be part two of our test. Again, I'd have to either tape that down, which is going to take some time, or tape around it. And just with the paint that I still have on the point of paint to show you how much paint it holds, this is going to go up and around. And when you get to this part, it's not, not a problem at all. A couple times around, and it's painted. So for part one and point, part two of the test, just cutting around something without actually taping it, it works quite well. Again, it holds a lot of paint, and it didn't drip. At any point in this whole demonstration, it didn't drip. And you don't have any appearance of brush strokes, which is really nice. We're going to move on and paint part of an entire wall with point paint just to show you how quickly and easily you can paint a big space. So for the second part of the test we're going to actually paint a larger space instead of cutting in. It says you can paint an entire room with the point and paint and we're going to put that to the test. We're going to just use this space here from the doorway across to the wall and down and we're just going to paint that quickly. Again let's just apply some paint. It's as simple as just rolling it over this roller in the paint pan. Again it's not dripping which is really nice. And once you start, you can just take whatever method you like. We'll just go back and forth quickly here. So back and forth. Again, not getting brush strokes, which is really nice. And we're just going to continue to paint this entire wall. And I'm definitely going a lot faster than I could with a roller uh, and, and a brush. And it's holding a nice amount of paint. A couple more rolls across the roller. I have more paint applied. And stay tuned, I'm just going to finish painting this wall and we're going to show you the end result, so stay tuned. Okay, so it's been about three minutes and uh, as you can see we finished painting this wall. Um, I'm going to go ahead and say that we're probably better off using a roller for a large space, uh, but definitely use the point and paint to cut it along the corner there and along the base molding on the, on the floor. It's really nice to use it there. And uh, maybe just cut in a little bit, but when you get into large spaces, your probably best bet is to use a roller uh, to paint it, you know, a little more quickly. Okay, we're back in the studio and back from our painting tests. I can tell you this, the point and paint is definitely easy to use. I'm no paint pro by any means, but I can pick this tool up and without even trying, you know, in a couple minutes I'm off and I'm painting. It definitely saves time rather than taping or really cutting in very carefully with a brush. And it's going to save you money if you don't have to buy tape. Would I use this product to paint an entire room and could have painted an entire room in less than an hour? I don't know and I probably wouldn't use the point and paint to do that. I'd stick with the roller. 
but I would definitely grab the point and paint to get into the corners, to get around my doors, to do the molding on the floor. It's a great product. Star Reviews is going to give the point and paint 5 out of 6 stars. It's definitely one of those As Seen TV products that does its job and does its job well. Be sure to check out the other As Seen TV product reviews at our blog at StarReviews.com.